What's going on guys? Today we're gonna to be going over Go High Level's new conversation AI bot. This thing is absolutely wild. I just got off a call with Go High Level's dev team and they give me all the details. So in this video, I'm gonna be going over everything you need to know, what it is, how it works, and how to use this bot effectively. I'm even gonna show you a live demo of this bot in action. And one thing I just wanna note before we get started, this bot is not only for your agency, but this is also for your clients as well. You can sell this to your clients and profit off of each usage, just like you can with text messages, emails, calls, and all the other AI features that Go High Level has to offer, this is the exact same way. So as you can imagine, this thing is going to sell like crazy and absolutely print money. Now, real quick, if you don't know who I am, my name's Connor and I teach people how to start their own SaaS business using this amazing all-in-one software platform called Go High Level. I made a free course on how to get started and I have a Discord server. Both of those are linked down below, so definitely go check those out after the video. Without further ado, let's get into it. So as you can see here, this is what the dashboard looks like, but first things first, I wanna show you guys how to actually turn it on so you actually get the option to have this conversation AI tab right here. So what you're gonna wanna do first is go to the agency view, go all the way down to settings, and then you're gonna wanna navigate to the company tab, and then scroll a little bit down and you'll see the option here to turn to turn on the conversation AI. So what this will do is basically enable it for all the sub accounts. Now inside of each sub account, it will be default set to off. So you're gonna have to switch it on for each of the sub accounts that you wanna activate it. So now we can navigate back to the sub account. Then we're gonna go down to settings and then you should see it here on the bottom left, you'll see conversation AI and you can just click on it. And now, like I said, it will be default set to the off position. Now you can see here, you have two different options to choose from. You have suggestive and autopilot. I'm gonna go over those in just a second. I just wanted to explain what the main goal of this bot is. So as of right now, it will not only be able to answer questions from your customers, but if they show intent to book a meeting, it will be able to send them the meeting link and even ask questions before it sends them the link. You can even train this bot on specific information by giving it different website links. You can kind of think of it like a little virtual AI receptionist that will be able to take customers from the point that they reach out to you all the way to booking a demo or a meeting with you. So now I'm just gonna run through all the different settings. You can see here, we have two modes we have suggested Suggestive and we have autopilot. Suggestive will be a little add-on inside your conversations tab window. So whenever a customer asks you a question, it will auto generate three different responses that you can choose from. So it won't answer automatically like the autopilot mode. You can think of it like a little chat GPT helper that you can use in the chat window with you to choose from a couple different options. And then obviously we have the full blown autopilot mode. This will completely take over the conversations for you inside the conversation tab. So you won't actually need to do anything this bot will completely take over and start responding to all of your customers' questions and try to get them to book a meeting. Now, right below this, you can see we have supported channels. Now, currently we have access to SMS, Instagram, and Facebook. So you can imagine how useful that's not only gonna be for text messages, but you can use this on your Instagram, Facebook, social media as well. And the dev team did tell me that they're looking to expand this feature really, really soon to the live chat widget and also the Google My Business messaging. So that's gonna be awesome. And then right below that, we have the AI bot trial. Now I'm gonna go over this in just a minute here. So we're gonna skip over it for now. We can go down to the appointment booking and pick a calendar. Now, as of right now, we just have access to be able to have the bot send a calendar link. Soon you're gonna have access to be able to have it send funnels. It will be able to actually fill out a form. It'll be able to ask questions to the customer and fill out a form based on the information that the customer responded with. But for right now, we just have access to the calendar. The dev team is really working on this stuff. So I'm thinking it's gonna be out within the next two to three weeks tops. So I can't even imagine what this bot is going to look like a couple months from now. This thing is gonna be an absolute monster. So next we have the conversation flow. You can see here, I already added in two of these questions. Basically what this is gonna do is you can set these prerequisite or pre-qualifying questions before the bot will send a booking link to the customer. So if the customer shows intent to want to book a demo or a meeting with you or your customer, whoever's using this chatbot. So the next thing below, we have the conversation flow. You can see here, I already put in two questions. Now, basically what this will do, if a customer or a client shows intent to book a meeting before the bot sends the link, the bot will ask the customer these questions so you can get a little bit more information before it books a meeting. So if you don't know the customer's name, email, or whatever, phone number, you can ask those questions before, and then once the customer answers those questions, it will then send the meeting link. Now if we scroll down here, you'll see we do have an advanced settings tab. I'm gonna come back to this in just a minute. Real quick, we're just gonna bounce over to the bot training tab. So here you'll be able to put any website links that you want your bot to be trained on. So you'll give it a link and then the bot will read the entire web page so it has the information that it needs to answer any questions. 
So as you can see here, I have my funnel page and then I have a couple different pages from Go High Level's website. So all you're gonna wanna do is take your website domain, put it in here, select all URLs in this domain, and then just click get data and it will let you select from all the different pages. And then you're just gonna click submit. It might take a couple minutes for the bot to learn everything, but once it's all good, you'll see this little train status here and it will, it will know all that information. So it will be ready for any questions. And the dev team did say they're pushing an update really soon. So we're gonna be able to use Google Docs and Google Sheets as well to train this bot and not just websites. Additionally, if you scroll down a little bit, you'll see customized bot responses with FAQ. So now you can add custom FAQ. So if the information is not already on any of those web pages, you can now add in custom question and answers for the bot to know in case that question is asked by a potential customer. So as you can see here, I just added in a custom FAQ of what is the pricing of upscale because I don't actually have my prices listed on my funnel page. So the bot doesn't know my pricing. So I added in this custom FAQ. What is the pricing of upscale? Upscale has multiple different plans and packages available ranging from 97 to $1,000. So in case anybody asks for the pricing, my bot will know that the plans range from 97 to 1,000. Now for the fun part, let's test out this bot live. And the really cool thing about this is they even added this little bot trial tab. You can test your bot as much as you want to make sure everything is running smoothly before you actually activate the bot. So we're gonna text the bot, hi. Hi there, how can I assist you today? Do you have any questions about upscale and our services? I say, yes, what is Upscale? Okay, you can see here, just said Upscale is an all-in-one platform for growing your local business. We offer services such as lead generation, marketing optimization, AI conversation flows, online reputation automation, and more. Is there anything specific you'd like to know? I'm just gonna say, I would like to book a demo. So you can see here, just responded, perfect, please use this link to book an appointment. And then the customer would be able to click on this link and book an appointment with me. And then once you're done with the conversation or you wanna test another conversation, you can just click reset conversation and it will wipe the chat log so you can go test it again. So let's actually ask it a little bit of a different question here. I'm gonna say, what is better upscale or go high level? So it actually gave me a pretty decent response here, but I'm actually gonna show you what would happen if it gives you a certain response that you don't actually like. All you can do is click on this da thumbs down here and you can actually edit the response. So each time this bot will keep learning over and over again as you start to ask it more questions and play around with it, you can keep kind of tweaking and making changes where needed so this bot runs completely perfectly and smoothly. And then once you make the change, you click train bot and now that custom question will get back added into the FAQ section inside the bot training tab. You can see it just got added right here. Now we can come back over to the bot settings tab and I'm gonna scroll down and show you the advanced settings. Obviously here, you're gonna be able to put in your sub account name or whatever account that you're using this bot on. So for my example, I'm just gonna use upscale. And then now we have for autopilot mode, there's a couple different options you can choose from here. So there's a wait time before responding. It's set by default to five minutes. I might lower that to two minutes. That's just so it looks a little bit more human and it's not gonna just respond immediately. If you wanna make it respond immediately, you can. I personally like to add a little bit of a buffer about two minutes I think is good. And then we have a maximum number of messages the bot can send to a contact. This is really just so a customer can't just spam your bot with a thousand questions and run up your bill for the AI bot. It's really just limited so the customer can't ask more than, you know, 10 questions or whatever you set it to. You can really set it to whatever you want. I think 10 is pretty good. So the bot will just go to sleep as soon as they hit that number 10 and then you can step in and answer the questions after that so it doesn't charge you for the AI. And then the one thing that we did not go over yet is what the suggestive looks like. So I'm just gonna show you that really quick just so you have an idea. So I clicked on suggestive, I'm gonna click save. And now I'm actually gonna text my bot a question. So I'll go to my bot here. And I'm gonna ask it, what is upscale? Send, and then we're gonna go back to the conversations tab. So now you can see here, we're back in the conversations tab. And as soon as the question got asked, now the bot is generating a couple different responses. So we'll just wait a second for this to update. There you go. You can see it just popped up three different responses. So now you can click on any of the three responses that you want and then just click send and then it will send right to the customer. Now, the next thing I wanna go over is pricing. Now, the default price at the moment, I believe is about five cents per execution, and you're able to upcharge that to your clients. So any of the sub locations that you have in your agency, 
you can just upcharge them as much as you want. And I believe they're gonna be pushing out an unlimited plan so you can use this bot unlimited number of times for about $49 per sublocation. That number is not set in stone, but I believe that's what they currently have in mind. So I think this tool completely opens the door for so much opportunity, not only to put your own agency on autopilot, but this is gonna open the door to a whole nother thing that you can sell to these business owners. And I think they're gonna absolutely love it. AI is such a trending topic right now. I think all these business owners, when they hear that they can get this conversation AI bot installed right into their business, I think they're gonna absolutely love it. And on top of that, they're gonna be pushing updates on this thing like absolutely crazy. They showed me the roadmap. You're gonna be able to make your bot have different personalities, different intents. You could even have it book an appointment in the actual chat window itself. So it will just ask the customer what day or time works for them and then it will automatically book it in on your calendar. So it won't even need to send them a link. They're just working on a ton of awesome stuff for this bot. You're definitely gonna see me posting a lot more videos on how to use this bot to absolutely print money, not only for your agency, but your clients as well. So definitely hit the subscribe button so you can stay up to date on all the awesome stuff they're gonna be adding to this bot. But definitely stay tuned for that. I hope you enjoyed the video and have a great rest of your day.